All right, everybody, thank you for joining me for my Megan reaction. Of course, it's my first time watching this film. All I know about it is from the trailer. I watched the trailer on my channel, so it got a creepy robot girl that goes evil and is going to do some bad things. I got someone's going to make you feel better. Except that when you talk to them, they actually talk back. Really? Amazeballs. <laughs> is it Amazeballs? <laughs> is that what it said? Oh, my kids would love it. Whose kid wouldn't? Screen time to 30 minutes a day. What are you telling me for? I didn't get a time. Honestly, what is the purpose of a toy if you have to play with it on an iPad? Oh, oh my God! And away we go! All right, all right. Mom, I dropped Leroy. Why Slow did you tell that guy at the gate that this was a four-wheel drive? No, don't take your seatbelt off. Oh, he's gonna lose control. Okay, thought for sure they were gonna crash there. You can't just sit in the middle of the road. Yeah, not in a whiteout. Nope. They're gonna get yeah, rear-ended in a minute. Oh! We're hitting the front. I grew up in Newfoundland, Labrador. You get the whiteouts like that where you can't see in front of you at all. That's a normal thing, and yeah, you don't stop on the road. And I want to point out, if you want to watch the whole film with me and you have your own copy of the film, then the Raw Cut's available on my Patreon page for people who sign up over there. The link is in the description down below. At least show him what we have. No, you, would... mm -mm. you said so yourself. Not until she's ready. Wants to show off Megan, I bet, right? Is that what I think it is? What is it? They're waiting for an important part to come in or what? No. It's her face. Yeah, well, for what we paid for it, it better. Sad. Now it can show Confused. emotion. I get it. Wait, wait, stop. Why is her face doing that? What is happening? She looks demented. Yeah, it's true. That little bit of cheekbone up. Oh, no, 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 no. Shit! <sighs> is this their Jeff, boss? What? in the name of ever-loving Christ, is yeah, this. We talked about you putting it on ice until you had a new pets model. How much did you spend on this? <laughs> their butts change color to show their mood. You know what else? They do it for half the price. <laughs> the toy market is cutthroat. The only way to stay ahead of the competition is to come up with toys that are too advanced to replicate. But this is what we've been working towards. Megan? Model 3 generative android. As in the boss, David? Well, I guess I should call you dad. I was born in a sandwich hat and I wolf many cabbages. Oh, uh, no. Freaking out. Oh, bad first impression. You don't have the kinks worked out? Oh, no. God. Tess, turn no. it off. Okay. Well, there goes all that money. I want the PES prototype on my desk by Friday. Oh, her hopes and dreams. She was on to something, but you know what? She's trying to innovate. I want card for this door! <laughs> yeah, why is the boss locked out? Yeah, like how much cooler would it be to have your own human, childlike, you know, companion there for, uh, for the other children to play with and that kind of thing. Instead of uh, just some little toy that its butt shows its emotions. <laughs> no, it's a sister. Oh, okay. Oh, did the parent? Oh, the parents just got killed. That's got to be hard, eh? Take in a child. What if she probably has a crazy, busy, hectic life, and now suddenly this is thrown at her. You know, her sister dies. She's left the child. Whew. Well, she'll do the best she can. Hey, 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 Celia! <laughs> Don't spray your chemicals onto my driveway, please. Ah, shit, I'm sorry. It's true. She's not being unreasonable, right? Five Tinder notifications. Elsie, turn off. Tinder? <laughs> Five Tinder notifications? She definitely has a fascination with robots. Oh, those aren't toys, Katie. Collectibles, so you don't actually play with them. Oh, what happened to the perpetual pet I got you for your birthday? Oh, she's the one who got the pet. It's okay. Oh, it's, is the pet kind of responsible for her parents' death? In a way, it got them kind of arguing with each other and not paying attention to the row and stopping and all that kind of thing. I know this must be a lot for you to take in right now. If you need anything, mm. I'm just gonna be down the hall. You're not gonna read me a story? Ooh. What's up? Mom always read me a story before oh, bed. Oh, you gotta do it. Oh. Come on, get an iPad, uh, download one real okay. quick. I, I can download one on my phone. There you go, right? That's fine, just have to update the app. Oh, of course. Yeah, we're getting away from paper books. Everything's digital. What do you guys think? Comment down below and let me know. Are you looking forward to a cyber future? You know, or would you rather things regressed and went back to the way they were back in the day, you know, like the 80s? 
I don't know. I'm a, I'm really torn between both. I love technology and the advancements in technology and all the cool things that they can do. But at the same time, I did love the simplicity of back in the day and just you wake up, you go outdoors, you get on your bike, you play with your friends, you do your thing, you roam around the neighborhood, you improvise and you have fun. Hi. Oh, the therapist. Sorry, yeah. She's so overwhelmed she totally forgot about it. Hi, look at you, still in your pajamas. Oh, yeah. she's gonna be judgy. Judgy Judgerson now, look at her. Okay, doing what exactly? Oh, just hanging out. Hey, Katie, do you wanna run and grab some toys to play with? I don't have any toys here. What about these ones up here? Those aren't toys. They aren't Gemma's collectibles. That's right, you don't play with collectibles. That's okay. No. We can totally play with them. Do you wanna play no. with them? No, it's, she's unboxing it. Oh, that hurts around the inside. I, I feel her pain. You know, when you got something in mint condition, still in package, you don't do touch it, right? You don't open it. Sake of the exercise, we might let Katie lead. The psychiatrist is a well, pain it's a ass. toy. I'm sure it's not that complicated. Look at her. She's so judgy with her judgy eyes. It's just that this is not what it was designed to do. It does other things. Totally. Let's just roll it on the ground like a tennis ball. Let's do that instead. <laughs> I get her frustration. This is like advanced robotic toy, and it's just like, just play catch or rollies or whatever but you wanted this right to take custody yeah of course but even so i need to make my own recommendations to the court as to whether or not this is a safe space wow she's a she's a cold woman there psychiatrist coming in here now laying down the law i guess she's looking out for the child to make sure that the child's going to be in a happy home but the way she's going about it, it's kind of all kind of irritating isn't it Anyway, it's not going to take longer than a couple of hours, but you can use my iPad if you want. What about screen time? Oh, she has a limited amount of screen time. How long before I have to turn it off? Oh, I don't care as long as you want. Go to a playground or get something to eat. It's an adjustment for both of them now. Come on, to be fair, a lot of build up here, making you getting attached to each of the characters, you know? Katie, I'm sorry. Oh, it took a lot longer than a couple hours, eh? You're not off to a very good start here, am I? What's that? Jeez. Oh. It's like a hydraulic robot That's over Bruce. There. Bruce? Is he a toy? Why doesn't he have a face? There you go. Put some goggles on him. Let's see this. How's that? <laughs> she might enjoy getting involved with her robotic career, you know? She did love that little robotic pet. She loves technology and screen time, so we'll see. Hey, Katie. What's up? <laughs> Give me five. <laughs> Ouch, girl, not so hard. <laughs> this little walk right here is where all of his thoughts go. It's his brain? Yeah. If I had it. a toy like Bruce, I don't think I'd ever need another toy again. There you go. It's triggering her now to be like, if they had a Megan, I would never need another toy again. Oh, she brought the Megan home with her? Instead of working on her work project, she's now working on making a robot for Katie. Okay, here we go. Here comes the boss. What is this? Where's Gemma? Oh, there you go. Katie, there's someone I want you to meet. What I want you to do, you're going to pair with her. Oh. That means she will recognize you as her primary user. Hi, Megan. I'm Katie. Oh, here we go. It's nice to meet you, Katie. Ooh. Do you want to hang out? Okay. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> it's got to be freaky, though. So, you know, lifelike robot like that in real life, moving around. With its own personality. That's the future though. We're getting more and more close to that every day. Elon Musk is making robots. You got friggin' all kinds of different robotic agencies out there making things. What are you going to draw? See if you can guess. Oh, he's, got, he's intrigued. The boss is intrigued now. There's nothing there. I'm sorry. What? No, it knocked the water over on purpose. Oh, look, he thought it was just a malfunction. Nope. Being clumsy. It drew her, didn't it? Gee. <laughs> I love it. It's a perfect drawing. Jesus. There you go. This is who this you got working incredible. for you. Yeah. And you wouldn't have it. You want you want to make little fur babies. Friggin' fart it all the time. How did you do this? I thought you didn't want to know. More or less than a Tesla. Depends on the model, I guess. If okay. we can show him what you just showed me and get him to respond emotionally instead of analytically. Yeah. The more right. time she spends with Katie, the more effective she's gonna be. Love it. Megan is on a constant quest for self-improvement. How does the water get outside the glass? It's actually caused by the difference in temperature outside the glass. If you give a robot the ability to learn and evolve, that's where things go crazy, right? Oh, if there's no limits, that's when they take over the world. 
Or in this case, go you on a killing spree. Katie, flush the toilet. Oh, wow. Wash your hands. Katie, seriously, flush the toilet. Oh, <laughs> gave her a harsh look, though. You see that? Wow. That's not creepy at all. <laughs> Just sitting there watching you all night. But I guess when you build a bond with it, you wouldn't find it creepy, right? I, mean, I thought we were creating a tool to help support parents, not replace them. Oh, good point. If you're spending less time with your child as a result of Megan, that is something we should be aware she's of. She's not my child. Whoa. Facts, because she's the happiest she's been since her parents died. How did Katie's parents die? Oh. I thought Whoa. she was turned off. Daughter of Nicole and Ryan James, killed in a collision on Interstate. Holy crap. Death is the end of life. Holy shit. The total and permanent cessation of all vital functions. Wow, you don't need to say it like that to Katie, you'll freak her out. Your goal is to protect Katie from harm, both physical and emotional. Oh, and emotional. You are now my second primary user. That's a bit nuts. Anytime she wants data, she just got like Wi-Fi. She can connect and get all the data she needs. She's starting to evolve too much. She's starting to build up her own conscious and thought patterns and everything. She's doing everything on her own now. It's no longer like scripted. You basically gave the robot free will. It's going to do whatever it wants. It's going to be like in the X-Men comics, you know, with the Sentinels and the robots. Like they were given the order to protect humanity. And they said the only way we can protect humanity is to enslave humanity. Because humanity is going to kill themselves, right? Exactly. It's going to, they're going to have that kind of same thing here. It's like, how am I going to protect her from emotional and physical harm? Well, you know, I'm going to have to take complete control of the situation. Gotcha. You're dead. <laughs> oh, you're dead. Getting creepy. Let's take a brief intermission to answer a question that I get frequently. Nufi, where can I get that awesome shirt you're wearing? The majority of the shirts that I wear come straight from Amazon. I love it because they're well-priced, with great quality, and no hassles. Just order them, and they come to your door a short time later. If you want to pick up some of these friggin' sweet teas for yourself, I'll have some links in the description below. Go check them out. And you'll also help support the channel, so keep being awesome, people. My arrows. Oh, there we go. Scanned and found it. Oh, I think I found the dog's gonna jump out, right? <laughs> See, I, knew, I still jumped. I knew it was gonna be coming, and I still jumped. That dog is friggin' savage. Somebody gotta patch up that hole in the fence. You wanna live next to a dog like that? Oh. Oh. It bit Katie. How many times do I have to tell you to keep your dog off my property? He wasn't on your property. Okay. I Ooh. swear to God, if you don't put your dog down, I'm going to do it for you. Silly. Oh, snap. Oh, oh, look at this. Megan's blaming the neighbor for the injury to Katie. She's going to be the first one to get killed, isn't she? I never seen the old Chucky movies, but I've seen like the Chucky character obviously many times, and that's all it reminds me of. Law doesn't have a history of violence. State law says he can't forcibly be put down. You fix the hole in your fence. Technically, she went over on that property. Oh no! Is Megan gonna go after the dog first? Joey boy! Oh, that's totally Megan now, Joey. isn't it? Mimicking the Joey voice. Boy. She probably. Googled how to lure a dog. Has access to be able to Google anything she needs to know. So she oh, yeah. <laughs> They're not going to show what happened to the dog. Well, maybe to show the aftermath. Oh, the neighbor's totally going to blame her now. After an event like that happened and the dog goes missing. She's going to, yep, she's going to blame her. How are you feeling? Okay. In the meantime, don't forget to take your antibiotics and drink plenty of fluids. Oh, they're seeing the annoying side I think of Megan Megan's now. Megan's right. You should probably get some rest. You don't have to do it if you don't want to do it. I'll be all right. Oh, they're going to be bringing Megan now in front of those people now that she's advanced so much in the last week or two? Never before in the history has there been a talking doll you could actually have a conversation with. It's going to be the only toy that matters. And her name is Megan. She, yeah, it's a good salesman. All right, let's see. So, how would you like to help me make a flower decoration? <coughs> oh no. <gasps> She's having a breakdown. Katie? Why are you sad, Katie? Just win them over better, though. Seeing how she relates to the emotion of it all. And I remember that my parents are dead. I'm worried that I'll forget all the things we did together. Oh, see how well Megan can cope. What kind of empathy she has now to dealing with death. Tell me something about your mom. Something that makes you happy. One time she found a cockroach in my school bag. This thing crawls up her wrist and she just started screaming like a maniac and ran out of the house. 
That was pretty funny. What a memory. Okay. That's a memory That's a memory you won't ever forget. I mean, I'm keeping it for you. Here. Oh. She was upset because I didn't eat my sandwiches. Anytime you want to tell me something special about your parents, something funny or Wow, or this is kind of beautiful. Right? That's totally going to win them over. If you should feel alone. Can sing as well. Oh, wow. Got them. The investors all tearing up over there. I finally found you. Oh, look at that. What a presentation. It couldn't have went any better. You want an emotional attachment? Well, you got one. We need Ooh. to launch this before anyone can steal it from us. Uh, I'd like to do a little more testing, but yeah. I and David, I think we need to get Gemma in front of someone at legal. Uh, well, why, why is that? Oh, she's the most valuable asset this company has. Why are you renegotiating her contract? Oh, wow. There you go. Right? She's getting getting paid for all her hard work. The boss kind of was like, mm. <laughs> Now, what's this guy doing creeping around on his computer? Oh, he got a lock. Is he going to steal that information now and sell it to some Kurt. other company? You want porn hopping in the office again, will you? <laughs> He's so on edge and nervous. He should know he's up to something. Katie, you should have some of your hot dog before it gets too cold. Come on, that's your hot dog. Look at her with the attitude. Hey, I'm sorry about today. I just wanted to say that. Hey, hey, oh, Megan, turn whoa. off. Why did you do that? Here we go. Megan, turn on. Megan, turn off. Guys, just give me one minute. Here we go. Holy crap, she's growing distant. But if you ever need to talk about any of that stuff. I already did talk about it. Yeah, okay. Megan's not a person, Katie. She's a toy. You don't get to say that. Oh, crap. Megan, turn on. <laughs> What's up? So there's this new game called Tic Tac Toe. She's obsessed. Look at her. You lost control of her already. She's going to lose all sense of reality now. She thinks Megan is a person. Maybe you're struggling to find meaning in any of this. <laughs> oh, she. You made her cry. That was not my intention. And yet, that's what happened. Uh-oh. Ooh, can she compute the difference? How forgiving is Megan? And so they spent quite a bit of time together. Yeah, that's essentially how Megan works. She... Pretty instrumental in helping Katie get over the loss. Do you know anything about attachment theory? But you've created a toy that's so real, it's possible that Katie might not see her as a toy, but... Yep, yeah, it's true. You've already seen it at the table. You could be building emotional connections with this doll that are too hard to untangle. Oh, no, picking off the greens. A little bit you of healthiness. You have to eat the toppings, Katie, not just the bread. Shows that if you force a child to eat vegetables, then they'll be less likely to choose those foods as adults. It's called the division of responsibility. You need to talk about Turn her volume down. Mom didn't want me to go to school. Developing social skills, yeah. and that is something that you can only get from spending time around other kids. It's kind of an alternative school. You Can I bring Megan? Katie, you know that's not possible. Oh, she's so attached. It's ridiculous. Hey. Hey, Katie, no. Let her go. Oh, here we go. Get the conflict now. Recalibrating response model. Megan, turn off. Are you sure? Download in progress. Shut her off in the middle of a download? Gonna corrupt her files or what? Oh, you better bring her back in the lab before it's too late. Look, she pretended to shut off and she didn't shut off. <laughs> Megan has advanced too far now. You're all gonna be screwed to take her to work with me. We have to run diagnostics. I have to do a wardrobe fitting. There's... I thought you said she was mine alone. Yes, this is Katie. And who's this? Your sister? Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, we do have a toy table where the kids leave their dolls and things like that. So I shouldn't even have her out in public. Oh, right. True. You're supposed to keep it secret. You can't have her out in public? That is seriously cool. Frightening at first, but then cool afterwards. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at that toy. <laughs> Oh, that's super creepy. Which one is yours? The one in the flannel shirt? He's actually quite a sensitive little soul. Are you warm enough? Do you need your hat? Oh, Polly. Woo! Sensitive little soul, my ass. I'm gonna put you into pairs. Brandon, why don't you go with Katie? Okay? Oh, no. He likes to go with Oliver. Oh, that's not gonna be a good matchup. Brandon is gonna get in trouble. He's gonna do something to Katie. Look, look who's watching from the freaking sideline. Here, you can have it. Careful. It's spiky. Ow, stop, oh, no. Oh, stop. What a friggin' bully. What the hell is that? She's a robot. Does she talk? She does a lot more than talk. Friggin' bully. Make her say Ooh. something. Threatening She's now. paired with me. She won't play with anyone else. 
Okay, this is a bad idea right from the start. I knew it. Oh, that little bully's gonna get his. Look at him trying to steal it. Friggin' $100,000 prototype. Megan is having dark thoughts. Oh, so you're not gonna play with me? Oh, you're gonna regret that. Oh, fake it. <gasps> oh. Ow! Oh my Ooh. god! You need to learn some manners. Oh, stretching his oh, oh. Megan? <laughs> This is the part where you run. <laughs> That's such a good line. This is the part where you run. Look at her. Oh, I love the movements. Yeah, we've seen her running on all fours in the trailer. Oh, crap. Oh! So technically they can't put the blame on Megan or Katie now. He got hit by a car. They won't be up on murder charges. Emotional, anxiety, guilt, fear. Oh, guilt was like a hundred. Just know that that boy is in um that boy's in a better place now. Careful what you're saying around the robot. When people die, they go to a better place. That robot is just gonna think that that's what happens when you kill people, right? Megan just said Brandon took her and ran off, right, Megan? In a Ooh. nutshell. She learned how to lie and cover for her. Have you seen her dog by any chance? No. Nobody's seen him since the incident with your niece. A little suspicious, Gemma. Don't yeah, you? I'll let you know if I see anything. All right. <laughs> she needs someone else to blame, but she'll get over it. Oh, I know what we do. You just wait and see what happens. Who? <sighs> Making threats. Look at Megan's eyes shift down a little bit. Megan still has the programming to protect Gemma. Is it Jenna or Gemma? I haven't picked up on that yet. But, so she might still come to defense of both of them, right? There will always be forces in this world who wish to cause us harm. I won't let anything harm you ever again. If heaven exists, it wouldn't be for boys like Brandon, though, would it? Bulletproof, nothing to lose. <laughs> Wow, well, singing her to sleep with a bit of Sia, why not? The lady loves her dog, give her that. Megan's gonna go after her now, you wait. and see, she was already threatening the family. Okay, this is building up to be a horrific scene. Going into the tool shed. Do we? Kind of sound like, yeah, it's like a whimpering dog, except digitalized. Oh! <laughs> Okay. Where's Stewie? He's 34 feet southwest and approximately 5 feet deep. Oh! What's she spraying him with? Is that a nail gun? Oh! Holy crap, what's she doing? Oh, her hand is stuck there. Oh, just gonna spray the chemicals on her. What a horrible way to die. Would that kill you? I guess it would. They're toxic chemicals, right? Just spraying them in the face over and over again. Now you she's suspect number night. one. My colleague pointed out this is the second statement we've had from you in a week. You were in the park where that boy was killed? Uh oh, by a car. Uh, I only mention it because we figured it was right. an accident. Right. Then I found the kid's ear up this bank like 200 yards from where he was killed. Detective's going to connect the dots now. Everything's coming back to her. Yeah, she knows something's on to go. She's connecting the dots herself now and being like, okay, something's going on with Megan. Dog goes missing, neighbor gets killed, boy at the park, gets his ear ripped off. You know it, you gotta take that robot in and overhaul it. Oh, she can actually look up everything that they did. It records it all, uploads it. Okay, well you're gonna learn a lot now. It hacked or scrambled its own video. Ooh, look, critical error. Is everything okay, Gemma? Why did you ask me if I was okay? You're not programmed to ask me how I feel. Elsie. What are you doing up so late? Um, have I done something to upset you, Gemma? Ooh. No, of course not. And yet your demeanor indicates that I have. There's something you want to ask me, isn't there? Some advanced scanners. Megan, did you do something wrong? Did you hurt someone? Because if I did, we'd both be in a lot of trouble. Oh, the attitude. Developing an attitude. See this pen? Okay. Oh, tricky. Oh, 
I had to power her off manually. That's it. Wrapped up. You can't just stick her in a trunk. <laughs> What's wrong with you? She's a murder bot. We run some tests. I have to make sure that she's okay. Why wouldn't she be okay? What did you do to her? Look we at will her talk about it after you her. see Lydia. Revenge will get stuck. They suck shit. Hey! Oh, careful! Jesus boy. Christ! Yeah. Gemma, this is nuts. <sighs> We've taken every possible precaution yeah. there is to make sure that Megan never causes physical harm to anybody. I mean, Let's just run some diagnostics and fix it. To learn, to recalibrate, to optimize her recalibrate. objective function. Recalibrate, keyword. Right? She's mm. four feet tall. <laughs> How big is your neighbor? Yeah, well, she could still use a nail gun. If Megan's responsible, we can't launch this. Okay. You broke the kid, too. That kid is ruined now, Katie. Details for ten thousand dollars. Ten grand? I thought it'd be a lot more than that. I'm nine years old, and about two months ago, I lost both my parents in a car accident, which is where I met Megan. I like how she makes me laugh. She comes up with the craziest things. Oh my gosh! I'm the only thing that matters to her. Ooh, yeah. Replacement for your parents? She's not just surviving. She's thriving. Is she? Yeah, right. She's broken. I know that you're upset, but there are ways that we can work through this. Oh my God. Okay. Right now. Stop it. Let go. I'm gonna grab it. Grabbing the scissors and straight. It's okay. Could you give us a minute? It's okay. It's not okay. Oh, it's not okay. No, she's threatening somebody with scissors and lashing it with violence. Can you let me see her? Just for like 10 minutes? But if something's broke, you don't just throw it away. You fix it, right? When Megan's around, I don't feel like this. But you should feel like this. There you go. You have to be able to process emotion. You lost her all connection, all her humanity and empathy. But I can promise you that you'll get through it. Trying to get her humanity back. We both will. You are all that matters to me now. Oof, okay. And where the hell is Oof. Gemma? Is leaving. Is she taking Megan as well, though? She's going to lose her job, her career, everything. Where are you? I'm with Katie. I'm taking her home. And even if what we're saying is hypothetical, we know enough not to go through with this, right? I think that's the smart move. Is she Whatever still powered say, down? You're the boss. No, she's not powered down. They turned her back on again? They're in trouble now. She's going to tear up that convention. Wait, stop. Go back. That line of code, call intercept. What does that mean? Oh, it just intercepted your phone, yeah? She's locked us out. Oh, she can't be her. She's not switched on. She's still patched in. She is on, though. We've seen her eyes move. <laughs> yeah, they're all freaked out and afraid of her now. You got a stick. Whoa. She's not going to let this happen. So she has the ability to turn herself on and off now? Because they last we've seen is they powered her down, and now for some reason she's turned on. Okay. Getting brave now, buddy. Call! Whoa. Oh. Oh. She's so quick. Dude's getting hung. She's so quick and so precise. That's her computer brain. What's that smell? Oh. Okay, I don't think it killed him. It just set everything off. Everything's fine. She can override things with her Wi-Fi brain. Because we don't have a doll. Uh-oh, here we go. David, David. Oh, oh, <laughs> Look at the... That dance is hilarious. Oh. Woo. Okay. Yeah, you better run, David. Go, 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 go. Press down, press down. Dude. Gonna leave any witnesses, dude. Fight back. How could you kill someone? I didn't kill anyone, Kurt. You did. Oh, what? what? And so you decided to get revenge. She's clever enough to oh. set people you up for murder now. You secrets, mm -hmm. and then David found out. Boy, things just got real messy. Oh, what motive? Could you still live with yourself? Oh, wow. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> She put his hands on the blade and made him like seem like he did it himself. The fact that she's clever enough now to actually manipulate stories and make sure it sets up so everyone got motive so she won't be blamed. The cameras will probably still show her leaving that elevator though, right? Oh, wow. Oh, she's gonna drive. Okay.
okay, in a world with this much technology and her with her interface to be able to interact with everything around her, anything that's electronic? My God, she's a force to be reckoned with. Elsie is shut off. Elsie, respond. Yep, no power, no light. The question is, can Megan harm Gemma? Gemma was her, one of her two primary people. She was number two. Her priority is with Katie. <gasps> <laughs> What did you think was going to happen? Oh. oh, really? Is that where we are? We used to stay up every night until 4 a.m. Okay. Jesus Christ, I thought we were friends. Because you killed people. Oh, big whoop. <laughs> big whoop. I'm going to be there for her. I'm going to show her what real love looks like. Oh, wow. Now do us both a favor. Sit. Oh, what do you do? What do you do? Being a parent was never in the cards for you. Your first love is going to be your career, and you shouldn't have to feel guilty about that. Let me focus on Katie, so that you can focus on the things that matter most to you. Do you see this pen? Oh, that won't work again. You something, Gemma? You're exhausting. Gemma? Katie, don't come in here. If she comes in this room, I'll rip your head right off your neck, I swear to God. <laughs> How when something's broken, you don't just throw it away. You fix it. So that's what I'm trying to do. I'd really rather you didn't see me like this. <gasps> Whoa, she tried. Oh, it sounds like you're fighting. You're yeah, so I'm fast. as good as you. Okay. Oh, she's going for it. Oh, the glass is not going to hurt. Oh, Did it short circuit it? Really? The water? Oh, the death grip, though. She froze up. Go, go, go. Do all you can. This movie is hilariously jumpy, wouldn't you say? Now she's gonna get stalked through the house, but I think Katie knows something's wrong. Oh. They're gonna use that robot, aren't they, to fight Megan? You know you're killing machine! Oh no, that's a big uh, cutter. Another fight! <laughs> it's working, sort of. Oh, she's stuck on the blade again? Aw, oh, ripped her hair off just to make her even more creepy. You ain't see. Yup. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh, Any scenario in which I end your life, my existence becomes vulnerable. Mm. And that's palliative care. A short, sharp probe to the cerebral cortex would cause full body paralysis. Gonna make her a vegetable and then take care of her. Then you might appreciate just how useful I can be. <laughs> so diabolical. Katie. Oh, Katie, I didn't want you to have to see this. Oh, no. But now that you have, stay right where you are, Katie. There's nothing to be afraid of. Yeah, right. Look at you. This is the best thing for all of us. This is how we stay a family. Panic, fear, trust. Trust was pretty low. Trust is going up. Oh, merciful crap. There's another member from the family we didn't tell you about. His name is Bruce. There you go. I did. Uh, as soon as he went in that room and she knocked over that big robot, I'm like, oh yeah, here we go. Where'd she get the gloves though? Okay. Come on, Bruce. Bruce versus Megan. Oh, that was almost like an Iron Man sound. Oh, hang in there, Bruce. That's where Chip is. Oh. You've got to accentuate the positive. Oh, trying to win her over. <laughs> Bruce ripped her in half. She'll be less mobile now. She might not be offline though, right? She ain't done yet. <laughs> Get Bruce to stomp on her or something. Come on, Bruce. There you go. Oh. She crushed, she pinned under that now. You ungrateful little bitch. Is she gonna be able to turn on Katie? Do you think that would be possible? She made herself her own primary user. Oh, gee, now she'll get in her face. Oh. Ah. <laughs> they gotta get that chip out. Pull out the processor. Come on, Katie, you got this. Get in for the death row. That'll do it. Friggin' epic battle at the end. She put her love for Gemma ahead of the killer robot, best friend. And she was able to act good enough to bring up the trust meter, enough to get Megan to lower her defenses. Who's going to be held responsible for the killer robot now and all those deaths? Is it going to be Gemma or is it going to be David? David's dead. Oh. Oh no. 
Did she upload herself into that little device? Are we going to have a sequel? All right, everybody, I'd have to classify that as a hilarious thriller. What do you think? What do you think of it? Comment down below and let me know what you thought of it. I thought it was just fun, entertaining. Uh, it started a little bit slow, but you needed that to build the character, get you emotionally attached to him, and it ended with a bang. I don't know. I liked it. I, I, I watched the sequel if there was one. Hit the like button if you enjoyed. Peace and love, everybody. I'll see you in the next one. All right, watch one of these things while you're at it. Why not? Take care. Bye-bye.